What's up with Montas? Where is he at with the shoulder right now? So Frankie, Frankie is going to have surgery. Um, it is now scheduled for the 21st uh, of this month. And then hopefully a few days after that, he'll, he'll come join us. When was this decision made, and what's been going on with him lately? I know he was shut down for a little while. Yeah, he, I mean, it, it's been a couple of different shutdowns where he was getting built up. Uh, you know, then he went out and saw Elitraj, who cleared him to, to go again. He was building back up and just still wasn't quite right, so went back, and, and now we've gotten to the point where they're going to go in and he'll do, he'll do, they'll scope it, and, uh, and then, you know, we'll have a better idea of the time frame, you know, once that happens on the 21st, and then hopefully he's here a few days later. Do you know what surgery it is he's having? You said they're going to scope it. Do they know scope what's it. wrong in there? No, so I mean, you know, they have an idea. I mean, he, once they're in there, they'll know, you know, do they have to, you know, you know, touch the labrum or touch the rotator cuff, and, and that'll, you know, determine, you know, if you have to add weeks to, 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 to the surgery. Brian, so based on what you know right now, what is the timetable for his return? Best case is he would be back late in the season, um, but we're really going to know. Um, a lot after the 21st when, when they know specifically what they have to do in there. Um, you know, if, if it's just the scope, then then there's the potential he could be back late in the year. And then just having pitchers and catchers report today, how did the first day go? Any surprises? Yeah, I mean, report day, you know, it's actually with – it's actually turns into a little bit of a light day compared to what we've been doing the last week with so many guys here and – and working out over at Himes and throwing lives and, and, you know, position players working out. So today's just kind of getting the physicals and, and getting all that knocked out. Um, you know, we had a couple guys that, that had sides and a couple of guys had to go over and throw lives at Himes. But, but otherwise, uh, today's a pretty light day. Chris in the middle. Before you guys traded for Frankie, I, I know he was dealing with shoulder problems with Oakland. And do you believe that he was pitching with – Shoulder problems with you guys after you guys traded for him? Well, I mean, yeah, I mean, because he, you know, he had shoulder issues when he got to us. So, um, you know, I, it, and I think with all these pitchers, you know, you can look and you're, you're going to have this similar things. That's why, especially with shoulders, they don't race into shoulder surgeries all the time. You know, you can treat these things and, Sometimes these things lay dormant. Sometimes they're asymptomatic. Sometimes they become very symptomatic. For Frankie, it was just that I think nagging thing that allowed him, didn't allow him to continue to get over the hump. You know, whether it was the first go around with Oakland, and then when he came to us and eventually, you know, got shut down, was able to get back. But then as he's tried to ramp up here a couple times this winter, um, he just hasn't been able to kind of get over that hump to to be who he knows he is. Eric, just following up on Chris's question, I mean, do you wonder if you traded for an injured pitcher? Um, look, we knew when when we traded for him that, um, you know, he had he had missed time with a shoulder. So, you know, I, I mean, that's the nature of a pitcher, though. You know, they're able to get back on the mound, and you know, pitchers will go sometimes their entire career with if you examined them on an MRI from a shoulder standpoint, there's, you know, labrum issues, there's rotator cuff issues, but things that they're able to pitch with all the time. So, you know, obviously having dealt with a shoulder situation and that it's manifested itself to where he's had to go to surgery, yeah, there's some level of that.